Hello there, Cindy Petronella here. If you are new, welcome to my spaceship. And those returning, I see you. I see you. Mwah. I appreciate it and mega love from me. Today, I'm gonna be talking about things you shouldn't do in Germany. Okay, so as you know, Germany has its own unique customs and way of life. And as a foreigner, you tend to adjust to it, perhaps. <laughs> but I try to just to take the good parts of it. Okay, so I'll just get right into it. Number one, shoes off. It's quite a norm here to remove your shoes before you enter somebody's house. Um, I wasn't used to that here in Germany. Everybody does that and I've, I have adjusted to that. It's not normal to have you around the house with shoes, which is understandable because, well, in Germany it's quite rainy most of the times and all muddy and it's not hygienic i would say to have mud all over your house so it's understandable if you decide to visit somebody in germany try to have a good pair of socks <laughs> please have good pair of socks it's not nice imagine now you have holes on your socks be prepared to have your shoes off when you visit when you visit somebody in germany okay. frost toast frost yeah cheers cheers mm -mm. do not do that around germans or in germany it's not good look in the eye okay here we go frost maintaining eye contact when you are toasting it's a long-standing tradition in germany yes some people might find it rude if you don't look at them in the eye but also it may have some serious effect on your life <sighs> one of the serious effect is <sighs> you might have seven years of bad sex yes so please look in the eye when you are toasting in germany okay <laughs> So, don't say I never helped you. Number three, wishing somebody happy birthday before their actual date. If you wish a German person happy birthday before their birthday, they will get irritated and it's not recommended to do that. They consider it bad luck and they might get irritated. Well, in South Africa, <laughs> we do that sometimes. I mean, if your birthday is during the week, normally we would like, I've done it, I would spend my birthday with my girlfriends during the weekend because people are busy and I would probably get gifts and people do say happy birthday. So in Germany, do not do that. You might irritate Germans and you might they might think for now you wish them bad luck i'm gonna teach you how to say happy birthday in german alles gute zum geburtstag so now you have it i'll just write it down here and if you know a german person or if you're trying to learn some german you can send this message number four punctuality do not be late I think I've spoken about this in my old video about being on time in Germany. Please, please, no African timing in Germany. 
does not work here if you want to make your appointments with friends doctor's appointment or any other arrangements do not be late germans are quite known for being on time for everything and they have a saying also time is money every minute counts in german or for every german my friends back home and family oh god <laughs> their time management are quite terrible if somebody says i'm coming now you never know when when they would come they must say i'm coming now now they are probably taking a bath <laughs> so that does not work in germany be precise with your timing and everything goes smoothly in germany do not take your precious time it does not work here yeah. time is money <laughs> okay number five traffic light robot roads if you are caught crossing the street on a red light you might get a fine or you might irritate some germans for example if there are young kids around and there's no incoming traffic and people see you walking right through the red light you might get a fine and yeah some parents or people might complain or shout at you which is great because you might be setting a bad example to the kids so if you are in germany do not do that wait until the green light and even though there's no cars you should wait and i find it great in south africa mm, people do this there's no car you just go and it's a bad example for the kids there are so many things that you shouldn't do in germany and I thought let me just keep it short as possible i hope you like my video and see you next time cheers